How's it going folks? I'm your host with the mostly wickedest Joker in Old Land, and today today we are back with more Fire Emblem Fates. But before we get started, if you guys go ahead and show some love to that like button, you already know that your support is appreciated. So, last episode, we hung out with some of our siblings, we met our mother, we fought some Faceless, and then we ran into the mysterious Azura, who was singing a song. So, that seems to be interesting. So without further ado, let's go ahead and just dive right back in and see what's up. <laughs> you... You look as if you're feeling better after a few days to yourself, Corin. <sighs> yes. Yes, I, I, I am. I still have many questions, but at least now I have a few answers. Thank you for giving me the space I needed to think. <laughs> uh, of course. I'm, I'm glad to hear that you're feeling better. If, if you wouldn't mind, I... I have a small favor to ask. Would you try sitting on the throne for a moment? Huh? And why would I do that? Please, listen. Well, this throne is infused with the power of the first dragons. It is said that those who sit on it reign in their true form of mind. I thought that if you sat on the throne, then perhaps... It can't be. Wait. You don't trust me. Do you think I'm un under some kind of Norian spell? <gasps> no, no. It has nothing to do with trust. I just... I just wonder if the Norians have been stealing away your early memories. So maybe this special throne could help bring those lost pieces back. Those sweet memories of me and your siblings. Oh, I... I see. I am so very sorry. I'm so sorry, Corn. I didn't mean to push you towards something you didn't want. Ah, uh, excuse me. Ah, uh, excuse me, Lady Makoto. The ceremony has... Excuse me, Lady Makoto. The ceremony is about to begin. You have my gratitude. Thank you, Yakamuri. Yakimura. Yakamu... Oh, it's going to be another one of those episodes. Corin, you probably don't remember him, but Yakimuri, he's one of our strategists and brightest leaders. We would be lost without him. Ha ha ha! You are too kind, my lady. The truth is, I still have much to learn. <laughs> that said, I am here to help in any way I can, Lord Corin. I'd like to make a public announcement about your presence here, Corin. There have been rumors circulating about spies from Nor infiltrating the castle. I would like to quench those rumors once and for all. Yakimuri, is everything ready? Of course. Of course, my lady. People have begun gathering in the plaza. Go on. Excellent. Thank you. Corin, I've arranged for Takayumi, Hanoka, and Sakura to give you a tour. I thought you might want to get to know the area a little bit before the event. I need to speak with Yakumiri first, but I'll meet you in the plaza soon. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be happy to show him around. Thank you, Mother! Please, listen. Azura, do you mind going with them as well? Very well. Not at all. It'll be my pleasure. Thank you. Thank you, Azura. <laughs> <laughs> of course, Corin. Hmm. Um. Show you around. I, 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 I think you'll, you'll, you'll love it here. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Sakura. A, a guided tour sounds like a great idea. Oh, oh. I hope Corn is truly okay with all of this. Hmm. 
Yes, I can't imagine his position. It must be a lot to process. That said, I think his return is a message from the gods. A good message, I hope. Why do you say that? Well... I don't know. After the invasion up north, I just... I feel uneasy. We should remain on high alert if you ask me. Editor's note, cut out the little space where I left and then came back. Hey, young man! Would you like to try my world-famous roasted potatoes? They're delicious and nutritious. I guarantee you love them. <laughs> well, sure, why not? Mmm, I've never tasted spices like these before. This, this is amazing! <laughs> You're so laddie! Here, take an extra one on the house. Share it with your lady Thank friend. You. Thank you very much. Here you go, Jura. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Corn. Hmm, you're right. This is delicious. <sighs> hmm. Everyone's really friendly here, and it's so bright and and open and it's, it's just, it's quite a contrast from the fortresses I grew up in. I'm glad you like it. Like I said, I've always been happy here. Ah. Huh, just don't get too comfortable, brother. Uh, what? I don't trust you. I don't trust you. You shouldn't be, shouldn't you be heading back to Noor soon or something? <gasps> Fucking bitch. Takayumi! Hold on a minute. Hey, who said you could call me by my name? You haven't fucking earned that privilege yet, bitch. No. Wait, what? That doesn't even make any what? sense. <laughs> Fuck you, excuse me. Listen. Azura's been in Hadosho for as long as I've been gone. Shouldn't that be enough to consider her family? Uh. Huh, I don't fucking care. I don't trust either of you. I just wanted to tell you that your fucking face bra. Um, uh, um I, I, I apologize for uh, Takayumi's rudeness. Uh, he's a bit of a dumbass. Anyways, um, how, how would you like to try sweet rice dumplings? It's a, a Shadeuian Dadaruian specialty. Why do we have such a hard name to pronounce? <laughs> I would love to, Sakura. <laughs> Thank you. Wait, what? I... You know, I'm very close with the girl in Noor who's around your age. What? Uh, I... Is... Is... Is, is she your girlfriend? Oh. Huh? Uh, no, she's actually my C... Oh, look at the time. Alright, everyone. The ceremony is starting. Let's head to the plaza. Oh shit, fuck. Well, this is gonna go bad quick.
you there. Show yourself. Dude, bro, God, what is that? An ancient dragon. I never thought I'd see the day. Route the enemy. Holy shit, that just happened. Wow. Um, I know this is like a T-rated game, but um, Nintendo, you you could have made like a like a little bit more impactful. And yes, it's still on the route the enemy. Your screen hasn't frozen. Um, it, you could have made it a little bit more impactful if you had, um, blood on my character's hands. Now, I know it's, like, a T-rated game, but, like, uh, blood seeping through the, the, sh the, the white of the, the shirt and stuff like that. Um, I'm not generally a fan of, like, gratuitous gore in video games, mind you. So when I say that and say that that would be more impactful, you know, I actually, like, that, that would have been better um, visual storytelling, because at this point, I'm just like, well, why don't they just, like, use a phoenix down, <laughs> right, like, is she actually dead, I'm sure she is, but, uh, yeah, I don't know, that's just, uh, just my thoughts, I know that's probably gonna get cut out, but, uh, be careful, yeah. Corin, a word of warning, if you would, <laughs> Corin, a word of warning if you can hear me. Watch for enemies carrying worryworm slayers. They're a type of blade designed to pierce dragon scales, and they work. And they work. They're designed to do this thing, and they do it well. Fuck it, do what I want. Corin, listen. My song can help you win battles. Using it can give you another chance to attack or take cover in a pinch. Please, do not hesitate to ask me for help. So she's like the dancer. So yeah, Songstress allows units to act twice in a single turn. So yeah, she's the, uh... No, I just want her to move. Vengeance shall be mine. Prepare to die. <laughs> oh, shit, fuck. He needs some heals. Like, I knew, I, I thought that that would be bad, but it's like, I didn't think it would be that bad. But it's okay, it's okay, we have... Stand strong. Be careful, everyone. These enemies are no mere faceless. One wrong move, and they are perfectly capable of ending you. I hope we can count on Corin, even in this new form. here. Staff. Blossom Festival. Okay. Nine. Huh. Well, that is just okay. Wait, no. I want her running around. 
actually, that's what we'll do. what I like to see. Okay. Oh, I can't pair, I can't combine. That's, huh. I guess I'll combine these two so that they get uh, a good guard on and then I'll just keep people by him, I guess. Oh shit, I should probably get down to uh, Ryomi, Ryomo, Ryomi, whatever his name is. Retaliation? That hundred percent retaliation? What? <laughs> why? Why would you? You got? Oh, cool. An HP tonic. I think that, doesn't that give me like five HP points extra or some something like that uh, for one mission? What's his health? 14, not. Hashtag not work. So we'll bring you up. Stab. Heal her. We can do this. <sighs> um. We'll attack. Looks like we have no choice. Okay, it's only four. I, okay, I should have played that differently, but whatever. Same. See, my original... I, no, I should have gone with the dragon and... Ah, well. Never mind. I'm doing it a an okay way, because doing it this way allows me to um, get everybody to do something, and uh, they get EXP. So, there's that. So... I'm like, I'm doing this wrong. No, I'm not. <laughs> I'm doing this the most EXP way. So, yeah, let's just do it that way. Shut up, Chris. Shut up, Chris. You know what you're doing. Ooh, don't hit, don't hit, don't hit, don't hit. Ooh! Oh, don't hit, don't, 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 don't get the retaliation, don't get the retaliation! If he, no, if he dies as an ally, he's not gonna die as a unit, will he? That would be stupid. All that and you only do five damage, bro. Well, you're whittling him down. Okay. Shit part. We wanna lure those guys to us. He's not done as a unit because I didn't get down there fast enough. You can kill me, but you cannot kill the spirit of Hodosho. Brother, no, 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 no. You, you, you have to step back. We can't afford to lose you, too. Uh, you are right. I'll retreat for now.
Hashtag was it worth? Leave it to me. Don't scare me like that. Nice. 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 Okay, so we need to get her back here to heal. We can do this. I kind of want to use my double move on my uh, on my dragon. So, what will this plus three ninety seven percent? So she's gonna hit him no matter what. Uh, a sixteen, but I will attack. First, so I should kill first. I should kill before he gets his retaliation. Provided I don't miss. Yeah, okay. Plus 10. But she would get a 2 at 19, or at 9. Uh, two at, yeah, that's 18, so she'd live with 1. Get up out, son. Get up out. Okay, so Corn's gonna take that. What's that look like? It's 24, so she's not gonna survive that. Shit, she might not survive that no matter what. Because if I move her, she's going to attack uh, Sakura, who... Okay, ten times two. Yes, we'll do that. We can do this. Nice. Okay. Good. I'm glad we we had another option. So. Anybody need heals? Kind of glad she can't get in distant or get in range because I want to move everybody. I would have probably attacked if she could move. Okay, so I'm gonna do 20 damage. So yeah, let's just. She will be what you've. God. <laughs> and you're gone. <laughs> no. Level up. Levels for everyone. And we completed without losing anyone. Nice. Rinka and Kaize were okay, I mean, I guess. <laughs> Azura, no, stop!
I, I finally remember. I, I remember. Fire it will. I'm disappointed in you, Subaragi. <laughs> that wasn't even my best trap. You poor thing. Orphaned at such a tender young age. Oh, you that's creepy. My child now. <laughs> that's creepy. I'm so sorry. Yes. I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Just... Just... Disgusted with myself. Are, are you okay? I can't believe what I just did to you. It was like... Like I had no control over myself. No. Please. Don't worry about it. That wasn't you. It was the blood of the ancient dragons that runs in your veins. Huh? I thought... Only the Norian royal family... had dragon's blood. Yes. The blood... of the dust dragon runs in the Norian royal family. And the blood of the dawn dragon runs through ours. But you are special, Corin. You can actually take the form of a dragon. Ah. I've heard of such a thing, but this is my first time seeing it in real life. Uh. Ah. Never mind me. What, what, what happened to all the innocent people in this town? No. No. I can't. I can't believe this. The entire town is devastated. An hour ago, these streets were filled with vendors and children. Listen. And so you see, Corrin, this is the work of the Norians. This is what they do. Let me guess. That sword you carried was a gift from King Gorin. Yes. <sighs> he masterminded this whole thing. It is not your fault. He knew you'd be captured. He knew you would be brought before the why? queen. Why? But, but why? Why would he do this? I'm sorry. I'm, I couldn't. I couldn't see this coming. <gasps> Your apologies mean nothing. This is all your fault. This is all your fault. Mother is dead, along with countless others. And it wouldn't have happened if you hadn't showed up on our doorstep. You don't belong hey. here. Enough, Tokeyumi. Stop. 
um... Your words won't change a thing, and besides... Shut up! Shut up, Azura! You're no different than Corrin. An interloper. Talk on me. You! Don't speak my name. I don't ever want to see you again. Brother. Are we really to believe that you had no idea that this what? would happen? Takayumi, what, what are you saying? Knock it off! You, you just saw Kor and help us defeat those Norian soldiers. Takayumi, please, you must listen to Korin. He is your brother. If, if you don't trust me, trust one thing. But, but Korin is your blood. <clears throat> My mother is dead, thanks to him. He's not my brother. I'm so sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. Everyone, I've brought nothing but, but pain to all of you. It would have been better off if I'd never come here. Maybe, maybe I should just please, leave. Please, wait. No, please, wait. I, I don't believe that. What? Please wait. I don't believe that's what Queen Makoto would have wanted. What do you know about it, Yakamuri? What did you say? What do you mean? What? Did you something... What do you mean? Did she say something? I hate to deliver bad news, but Queen Makoto foresaw her own death. This isn't your fault, Corin. King Goron sent these events in motion. And the queen speculated that there may be events. And the queen speculated that there may even be darker forces at work. She didn't know when or how her death would strike, only that it was certain. And there are other things. Please, take a look at the statue. I have to shake my head while doing his voice. It's kind of like this William Shatner thing where I move my head at different angles, so like... Reading his lines while I'm doing it is kind of difficult. Huh? Is that a sword? It can't be. What he said. Indeed. This is the divine sword, Yato. Much like your weapon, Ryuma, the divine Rajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajajaj
There. You should be okay now. This Dragonstone is attuned to you. Be sure to keep it Thank safe. Thank you. Thank you, Azura. I don't I don't know what I'd do without yes. you. Um Oh, um Huh? I'm I'm sorry. Did 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 I say something to make you uncomfortable? I, I know we've only known each other for a short while, but I feel close to you. You have already risked your life to help calm my dragon form. I only hope I can repay the favor someday. <laughs> Thank you, Corin. I feel close to you as well. I feel safe when I'm with you. I wish to keep you safe too. That is why I'm coming with you to face Nor. Yes! Not only do I get a dragon stone, I get a dragon form, but then I get a cool dancer early in the game that allows me to take two turns. Now all I need is all my Pegasus Knights to learn Gale Force. And then I would win. Alrighty then, ladies and gents. That's going to be it for this episode of Fire Emblem Fates. Let me know what you guys thought in the comments below. And like always, stay frosty.